Hi everyone, I'm Stone Kaufman with Blue Mile Marketing. Uh, we're here today to take a look at the email to Salesforce feature. Uh, you can actually use your computer in the same way that you've been using it to send emails to uh, potential clients or leads or existing clients and still have that attached to their, uh, to their contact on Salesforce. Uh, makes it very convenient. Now there's a way to do it inside Salesforce and send the email from there but uh, some of you might not want to do it that way so I'm just going to show you how you can continue to use your existing email service. Um, all you would need to do, I'm going to send you out an email that has a link to um, where you can find your unique email uh, that you're going to use in this process uh, but if you lose that email that I'm sending you, you can always find it. And this is how you come up here and click on Setup. And down to the second option over here, Email. And then it's called My Email to Salesforce. So if you click on My Email to Salesforce, it comes up with all this information, how to use it, um, it enables you to set it up uh, in the way that you see fit. This is your email right here. Okay, so if you right click and copy, or you can select it and copy either way it doesn't really matter but then when you go over to your email and that's not okay now this is actually gonna look a little bit different if you're using a PC I'm not sure how many of you have Macintosh out there but uh, this is my email program and I'm just gonna create a new message okay so I'm gonna send that to um, a lead that I'm talking to which in this case I'm just gonna use myself alright um, but in order to attach that in Salesforce, I have to BCC, blind copy, that unique email that we just got off of the Salesforce page or that you copied out of the email that I'm sending you. Okay, so you can save that into your addresses uh, in whatever program you're using. That way it's easily searchable. Just call it email to Salesforce or something like that. Um, and then anytime you send an email, and you can do this from your phone, you can do this from multiple uh, different computers. That's the convenience. You don't have to log into Salesforce. Just tag it and it'll automatically search Salesforce for whoever is in the two. And I believe you can use multiples. So if you send it to a couple people, it'll attach it to all of them. But it'll search and it'll, it'll actually put that under the activities as an email or communication to that contact. Put in whatever uh, subject you want and any uh, body that you want as well and just send that. And then when you go into your Salesforce, uh, it will actually automatically tag that. So just one moment. Okay, and now from my home screen in Salesforce, I'm going to go ahead and just search for myself. That's who I sent it to. And when it comes up with uh, the client or the account that I was sending it to, it should have automatically linked it. And you'll see here in, under activity, there's two because I've done this before. And there's the most recent one. It shows up right up there in the pop-up. You can edit, you, know, you can delete it if you want, anything you want to do. Uh, you can view. And there, as you can see, is exactly what I emailed. So it's a way for you to keep track of everything, all the communications going on between you and that contact. Um, and if I go back over to my email, I can see there's my email because I sent it to myself. And then here it tells me success, email to salesforce.com was success and it was attached to the following record. Okay, now when you go through, if you want to test this, make sure that you don't do like I did and choose yourself. Uh, just send it to me. So when you send that out, just send it to ston.kaufman at uh, bluemilenetwork.com and uh, that'll actually work better for you. Um, if you do it to yourself, it just doesn't work quite as well. I had to change it around a little bit for this demonstration. Uh, if you need to test it, if you have any questions, uh, just uh, give me, uh, shoot me an email or give me a call. I'll be more than happy to help. I hope this uh, was helpful to you, and uh, we'll see you next time.